Have you ever gotten the open door error when you turn on your pinball? Today I'm going to show you how to fix it. And that's how we do it. The reason you get the open door error is because the batteries on your board have died. Well, in order to fix that, and to eliminate that problem in the future, we're going to install the NVRAM Battery Eliminator. Alright, so we're going to come up here. Remove this glass. Right here are your batteries. We can see that one is missing. I had taken that one out earlier. This actually is, has broken the spring and I've been able to finagle it in there so that it currently works. But we're going to replace that so we don't need to worry about it. Especially if battery leakage or any acid comes down, or if batteries get old and it gets on your board and fries your board, it's never a good thing. So we're going to make that a permanent fix today start by popping these out. Here's that spring that was broken. Now if you can see here, this is what we're going to be replacing. So how to tell which one we'll need, we'll zoom in here. As you can see, the number on there is U212. Alright, so we come over to Pinatech.com. I'll put a link in the description below. Hit your products here. Come over to NV RAM Memory Modules. Click on that. If you're not sure which one you need, go ahead and click on it. You can read the descriptions down here. We can see right here is for uh, Sega White Star. And here's our board number, the U212. Uh, we can click on it pulls up a picture and this is our board right here is the batteries that uh, we're going to be replacing and it shows exactly where that chip needs to go right here so we can just come back throw that in the cart there they're $24.95 plus I believe a little bit of shipping and handling so just over 25 bucks that's not bad then you don't have to buy batteries anymore so we've gotten our package today, shipped to us. We're going to open this up. Take this out, looks pretty good secure. And this is what we're looking at here. This is what we're going to be replacing. As you can see, this is 6264 NV RAM. This is going to be for Stearns and Sega pinballs. And that little circle is going to be very important. That's going to be uh, the dot that indicates pin number one. We want to make sure that we put this in the right spot when we're changing it out on the board. Alright, so when looking here at the pin, you can see right here is pin number one. There's the circle. So when you install the other one, we're going to have to make sure that pin number one is right down here as it's oriented to this board. What we'll do is we're going to take a flat headed screwdriver, just like this, come up underneath and you'll pull it off. Now if you end up pulling this off and you're not sure where pin number one is, you can look at where it sits and there's a little half moon here. And that little half moon is going to match the little half moon on the NV RAM that we're going to put in. So that way you also know that that's where the top or the pin number one should be oriented. And you can see that right here on this chip. Here's the little half moon. So now we're going to install this by just popping it in. So once it's installed, Zoom out here. And we'll turn on the power. Now 
Now you're still going to get the open the door air. So we open the door, close the door. And there you go. All done. And that's how you replace the batteries with a NV RAM. Thanks for joining us today. If you liked what you saw, please hit that like and subscribe button so we can get more content out to you. If you didn't like what you saw, smash that thumbs down button twice to really let us have it. Until next time, this is John for That's How We Do It, brought to you by Rustic American Woodwork.